Hello again. Are you ready for more SSRS? So today I'm going to talk about automatic merged sales in SSRS. So have you ever come across a report where you have header files, not header files, headers in your SSRS report and once you export it, you notice that some of the columns and or rows are merged together and you don't know why. Well, this video will explain why. The problem is when your picture, your logo, or any other text box that you have at the top of your report is not lined correctly with the rest of your report. So I'll show you an example of that in a second once I finish talking to you about it because that's the point of all of this to have face-to-face -face interaction and not just look at the computer screen. So I'm going to explain first and then show you second. In your report you have for example a header that starts at the beginning of your report. This is your picture and this is the data in your report. And then you have another header, like a text box with the name of the report, and then you have the data down below. If this text, if this picture logo isn't aligned correctly with the text box that's right below it, for example, it's in the middle and this one starts over here, it's going to merge the cells so that they can align correctly. And in the next shot, I'm going to show you how to correct that. Thanks for watching. So we have our SSRS report, we have our two headers that are misaligned, we have our data down below, and now we're going to preview it and export it to Excel. Excel, sorry for the delay, the capture, screen capture that I'm using. It's hard to see the pointer, so a bit of a delay, but we'll work through it. So I'm going to save my report, open it up, and we see that we have our columns, A, B, C, D, E, F, and we have our two headers at the top, header one and header two. And then when we go down to our data, we see that columns A, B, and C are merged. And we don't want that, so I'm going to go back to design view. And I'm going to align the headers so that they are lined properly. So I moved header 1 to the left. I'm going to move header 2 to the left so that they start at the same point. All right, now I'm also going to move the end point of header two so that it stops at the same point as header one and as the data down below. So once we see that blue line, that you see that blue line right there, that blue line lets us know that everything is aligned correctly. All right, so I'm also going to move over to the left my expression that I have there and I'm going to extend it so that it stops at the same point as the gray line that's right above it because otherwise we'll get uh, merged columns again so I preview the report I export it to Excel and now we see that those merged columns are gone another thing you don't notice is that the rows were no longer merged but they were sort of misaligned one was bigger than the other so I'm just going to move header one the bottom of it just a little bit to shorten the length I preview it and now it looks good so now I'm just going to go ahead and export my report I'm going to save it and no more merge columns or rows thanks for watching